Hi, I'm Rob with the LED Lights, where we specialize in high efficiency, low cost, reliable LEDs. Today, we will be installing the 200 watt ultra high lumen dimmable LED high bay fixture. But before we begin, it's important to remember to take the necessary safety precautions and consult an electrician first. This demo is for use of professionals only and should only be done by licensed electricians. This high bay fixture is UL and DLC certified. We have a variety of light output options to best suit your needs. We also offer this high bay in LED wattages ranging from 50 to 300 watts with more than 45,000 lumens available. This fixture will be brighter than even a 750 watt metal halide light. It has the option for dimming and motion sensing. It's also waterproof, so if it ever gets dirty, just spray it down with a hose. It also has the option to take different lenses that give it different beam angles and a diffusing shatterproof lens. This durable model will withstand a wide range of temperatures. Now that you have everything in place, we are ready to mount the light. This light can either be hung or mounted with available brackets. This light is easy to install. Just snap it into place and plug it in. See the enormous difference that this high bay can provide for your area. The difference is night and day. Now we will show you how to install different lenses for unique beam angles and add dimming and motion sensors to this high bay. To replace a lens, simply remove the metal ring holding the lens in place. Remove the rubber gasket from the original lens. Carefully secure it around the new lens. This will preserve its water resistant integrity. Place the ring back on and secure it down with your six bolts. Here we have a remote controlled dimmer, which comes with a wall mount for the remote. First, insert your 0 to 10 volt dimming lines. With this model, white is negative and blue is positive. Lock the wires in place. Then insert your black line and white neutral from your power supply into the input part of the switch. Coming off the high bay, the brown wire is lined and the blue wire is neutral. Connect these wires into the load side of the switch, again making sure they are securely fastened. Finally, connect the ground from the light. With two easy snaps, you're done. Here we have an occupancy sensor with customizable settings. Installing the sensor is very similar to the last switch. First, insert your 0 to 10 volt dimming lines. Coming off the high bay, the brown wire is line and the blue wire is neutral. Insert your black line and white neutral from your power supply into the input part of the sensor. Connect your ground lines together. With two easy snaps, you're done. Securely mount the sensor to the side of the light using the two bolts provided in the kit. Thank you for checking out our video. To find more helpful tips like this, please visit eledlights.com. You can also call or email me anytime. Thanks and have a great day.